Christmas greens finished. There's no rest for the hard work of those. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care in hopes that St. Nicholas would soon be there. Oops, that's mistake number two. Those socks from the fireplace are to dry out. These kids in the house can't seem to stay out of the wet snow. The children were nestled all snug in their beds while visions of sugar plums danced in their heads. Sugar plums, sugar plums. These kids are dreaming about gifts. Gifts and stuff and things. They don't care if the stuff dances or not. They just like the loot. Mr. Mouse, you certainly seem negative. Are you a little disturbed by Christmas? Christmas? Ah, oh, humbug. All it is is work and worry and loot and bills and gimme gimme. Got it. Oh no, Mr. Mouse. Christmas is much more than that. Let me grab the first edition of The Night Before Christmas and see if that helps you understand. Twas the night before Christ's birth, and up in the sky the angels were prepping to be heard on high. Tonight's the night. God is sending Jesus down to earth. I'm so excited. Who should we tell the news to first? Let me check my assignment scroll. We are to go to the hills outside of Bethlehem to a group of shepherds. Shepherds? Shouldn't we tell some important people first? It's God's plan for you to tell the shepherds first. The birth is just the beginning of the plan. Well, God knows best. Let's get the other angels and head out. Lead on, Gabriel. hillside while watching their sheep, a group of young shepherds were falling asleep. Then suddenly out of sight came a light. An angel appeared, making everything bright. Peace to each man, for you need not have fear, for the news we have brought you will find very dear. A baby is born the night of the, his birth. He is coming to save all the people on earth. In Bethlehem town you will find this dear child with Joseph and Mary, his mother so mild. Sharing a manger with ox and sheep nestled in blankets, the baby sound asleep. God, good, good news, we bring you wonderful night. He did it for you to wind through the sight. Just 
delivered the news, the shepherds, the shepherds were searching with no time to lose, and just as the angels had told them out loud, they found Jesus with Mary, and Joseph so proud. Luke chapter 2, verses 1 to 14. In those days, a decree went out from Caesar Augustus that the world should be registered. This was the first registration of King Herod with the government of Syria, and all was to be registered, each to his own town. And Joseph went up from Galilee, from the town of Nazareth, to Judah, to the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was the house of lineage of David, to be registered with Mary, his betrothed, who was with his child. And when, while they were there, the time came for her to give birth. And she gave birth to her firstborn son, wrapped in him swaddling cloths, and laid in a manger, because there was no place for him to keep them in the inn. And in the same region, there were shepherds out in the field, keeping watch over the flock at night. And an angel of the Lord appeared to them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were filled with great fear. And the angel said to them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good news of great joy that will be for all the people. For unto you is born in this day in the city of David a Savior, who is Christ the Lord. And this will be a sign to you. You will find a baby wrapped in swaddling cloths and a man lying in the manger. And suddenly there was an angel in the multitude of the heaven host praising God, saying, Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace among those with whom he is pleased. story. Jesus was born on the first Christmas day? That's right. Jesus was born on the first Christmas day. A gift from the Father. He planned it that way. And every dear person who hears and believes that moment from Jesus a part of receives. For all folks have sinned and have gone their own way, but God listens closely when we choose to pray. I choose to love Jesus who came down to earth to live and to die and to give us new birth. Terrific! Christmas isn't all about loot and gimme gimme got to. It's really Jesus and joy and love straight from God. Congratulations! Now you know the reason for the season. <laughs>